Fast foods and unhealthy eating have become the norm for families in many Chattanooga communities. And that's why a group of community partners are taking action, helping people with little or new access, no access rather, to grocery stores. News Channel 9's Jerry Askin is live now on East 3rd Street with more. Jerry. Well, Kevin Calvin, this truck has all the healthy and fresh foods you might want. The CDC says more than 72% of residents in Hamilton County go without the adequate portion of fruits and vegetables they need. And this truck is helping to address that problem. Diabetic, and uh, I've had three strokes and, and uh, all this junk stuff right here, so it's not good for you. For Sandra Ratliff. Oranges. I got some peaches. Loading up her basket of fresh produce. It's how she shops and gets her weekly dose of healthy foods. Her nearest grocery store is almost two and a half miles away from her home, a 45 minute walk. If I don't have bus fare, then I have to walk. I use my buggy and I go to the grocery store and come on back home. For the past two years, the food truck has made stops in 11 Chattanooga neighborhoods. Ratliff is one of more than 71,000 people in Hamilton County who live in a food desert, meaning she has little or no access to a large grocery store. That's about 21% of people in Hamilton County. And they'll have to catch a bus, ride a bus for, you know, three hours just to get two armfuls of groceries when you're 86, and you can't do that. You know, it's 95 degrees outside, so it, it, it helps a lot. A food desert is mostly in a low-income neighborhood where healthy food options are scarce. I wish the mobile market would come to my neighborhood. DeAndre Pointer lives in Fort O and crosses the state line every week to buy food from this food truck. They have greens, they have your green vegetables, they have your red vegetables and things that can lower cholesterol and keep high blood pressure down. And besides healthy eating and a convenient way of getting her groceries, Sandra Ratliff says the food truck has been good for one more thing. Oh, I lost about 100 pounds. Now, don't worry, the mobile market here takes EBT and food stamps. They run from Monday through Thursday. And to find out their schedule, just head over to newschannel9.com. For now, we're live in East Chattanooga. I'm Jerry Askin. Back to you all.